Now, new tonight and only on 10, Superintendent Dr. George Parker's final letter to Newport News Public Schools a little more than a month after police say a first grader shot his teacher in class. 10 on your side obtained a copy of Dr. Parker's final address the night he was fired by the school board. 10 on your side's Michelle Wolf joins us tonight with more on the contents of that letter. Michelle? Lena and Tom, the letter from January 25th was written immediately after the school board voted to terminate Parker as superintendent. It's addressed to everyone in the school division. The one page letter starts off by thanking the school board and all employees of Newport News Public Schools. Superintendent Dr. George Parker was fired in a 5-1 vote during a specially called meeting January 25th, five days after a trespassing and assault incident at Menchville High School and less than three weeks after a shooting at Richneck Elementary. Parker states, this decision was made without cause and after careful consideration of the future of Newport News Public Schools. Parker says, quote, I am truly indebted to you for the hard work that has been on display throughout my tenure. I will truly miss you all. Parker references first grade Richneck teacher Abby Zwerner and the Richneck community as they, quote, recover from this unfortunate and tragic incident. The remainder of the letter focuses on the progress Parker says the district has made during his five years as superintendent, where teacher pay increased by 19.6% and bus drivers saw a 14% pay increase. Parker also cites the district's mental health services and mental health therapy, where the Newport News Public Schools received national recognition for its clinical psychological services. Parker ends his final address saying he will continue to root for the entire Newport News Public Schools team and future leadership, wishing the district a bright future. Dr. George Parker was officially relieved as superintendent this month. He walks away with a $502,000 severance. Teacher Abby Zwerner continues her recovery from the shooting and has hired an attorney with plans to sue the school district. Michelle Wolf, 10 on your side.